there's a trail. Let me see if I can zoom in. As you know, I'm not the world's greatest videographer. Maybe you'll be able to see that. Okay. We're at a turnout or whatever at the Heron Lake State Park. Now I will say there's a bunch of trails. Some are, I mean, just right here. Some are human, some maybe not. You see the lake way back there? This is a beautiful place. over here and have a picnic and your view is phenomenal hmm here's what kind of trees are up here because I think we're pretty high up but I'll check and see Kind. Then there's this tree. See, I don't know what a pinion tree looks like or pinon or what it is. Pine cones all over the place. You see, there are regular, regular pine trees. That's silly. Okay, we're on our way to the dam. Here we are, Heron Lake State Park Dam and Reservoir. What you see in the distance, 
shutting out there. Let's see if I can get it. I don't know. Is a boat dock. That's a boat dock. We're gonna go down there though and see. Here we are, a little bit closer. Wait for Rex and the dog to catch up. All right, look at that. It's some kind of plateau. And there's the Rio Chama Overlook. Which says it's closed, but we can probably walk over there. We'll see in a minute. There's islands out there. A little ways back, the overlook was called Island View Overlook. I didn't know what that was myself on, off of Google Earth. Hope you can see it. It's a boat dock. I do wonder how high the water gets when they let it out of the dam because, or if they even do. Because that looks like it's been. other side of that Heron Lake Dam, which Rex said that was just a spillway. I mean, it wasn't a spillway. It's just a dam. It was held back with big old rocks. But you see that sign area closed? This is the Rio Chama Overlook by the Heron Lake Dam. And you got to be really careful. Things, lots of roads are closed. Um, all sorts of reasons why they close. We'll talk about that later. Okay, luckily they left open the walk down area. Just closed the building is all they did. So, here it is. The dam. Well, something of the dam. We'll see another part here in a minute. There's your prop. What's in that hoe? Not big enough for a treasure. Okay, now we're gonna try to get down there. Because that's where actually the concrete wall part of the dam is at. So, hang on. Rim area closed to public. Use Rio Chama Trail for access. Definitely check it out and see if we can get down there. And these are pretty cool ledges right here. I think this is the Rio Chama Trail that they're referring to. And I can see why they closed it if they did. I hear people. 
This ground is really soft right here. That's crazy. Okay. Let's zoom in down there. And there's something private property up there on the hill from this here Rio Chama area. Something up there. Yeah, I bet they got it. Degradation, degradation. <laughs> Hear that ding dong dog barking. We're gonna see if we can get on this plateau over here. Stand by. Okay. Sorry. There's one way to get up on that plateau. So, we just want to go down here to the bridge. Alright, this is not a very good view for you. So we might have to climb up on that plateau. Stand by. It sure is pretty. parked here. We're going across the street to that plateau. Here we are on top of the plateau. That's just what we call it. Look at all these rocks. And I tell you what, I'm breathing heavily. And we just walked what, 100 feet maybe. <laughs> We've stopped in the shade. To catch some breath. Hey Rex. Hey Tam. <laughs> Say hey Bink. Hey Bink. <laughs> Where are you? I can't even find you. Standing in the shade. Disappeared. He did. Okay. How did all these rocks get here? Because that's a big slab of bedrock. That's right. See? With little rocks thrown all across it. See? That's the... base rock and then crazy rocks everywhere there's very little above us so <laughs> okay here's another thing be careful where you go some cactus are low to the ground Something between your legs Oh, see that? Probably can't because I got a shadow on it. I'm stepping right between this accidentally. Okay, we're over on the peninsula. We still have to go down there for the dam, but I wanted to stop and show you this. Holy moly. Now, if I had a sun umbrella, and some snacks, this is a gorgeous place right here. Stunning. See this, what we're standing on? That's wild. But, okay, now, truthfully, I could see somebody laying down dying right here. Because 
That's just beautiful. Let's get along here on the cliff side. What do you think, Rex? Could you lay down and die here? Maybe so. It's pretty nice. Let's, let's keep our eyes open for a blaze. Because then we could look quickly down. We sure could. We ain't going down, but we could look down. <laughs> well, it's not the Continental Divide, but... It's a deep one. <laughs> it's deep. Can't see the bottom of it. I had a flashlight maybe. But... So there's the plateau. from Heron Lake. We're going over to Elvedo now. Bye. It's kind of rough going walking on these rocks right here. Step the wrong way and holy cow. You can't have it, Tammy. Yeah, there's no rail, so if your kid's prone to jump off of things, this ain't the place for you. Yep. And just so you know, yes, we are looking in all the crevices everywhere as we go along. We're almost at the end where we can get a good picture. Stand by. Last couple of days, there's been high wind warnings. And yesterday and the day before, I would not been standing right here. Call me a chicken if you like. But it wouldn't be advisable. Well, here's the thing. I don't see that big wall, dam wall, so we're thinking we're at the wrong dam, but we'll get this here footage for anybody curious about the spot. We have found no way to get down there. But, I'm sure some teenagers could. Or something, some kind of path. Oh, that road? Yeah. It probably eventually leads down here. Rangers have to come down here periodically, I'm sure. Yeah, probably so. Let me see if I can zoom in on that. What's that over there? Just a big white rock. The spillway there itself has a fence around it. Aren't those cute? Now there is parking here. That's for sure. And it's dry. You can cross over onto that levee. And I will say, this is a beautiful spot right here. You could lay down and die and see all that stuff. Well, not when you're dead. Bye. Okay, this spot here is called Heron Lake Dyke and Spillway. We don't know what's going on here. We can't 
find that place that I have. We can't find it. If that's not Alvedo, then there's not an Alvedo anymore. Because that direction, there is no water. There is no water on the side of, on the other side of that spillway right there. Nowhere from where we came from. Okay, I'll walk down from here. But see, the problem is, what if there was water there? There was once. You know when? When there stopped being water there? Structure. I don't even see it. So we're at a loss. We don't know what to think about it. But look at that. That's not a sandy beach. That's rock. That's pretty cool. We don't know. Oh, see, there's not another side. It ends right down there, right? Right? It's, it's, this, this structure here is the dike. All this there's road. like a road right here, okay? That is what I'm talking about, the road. Okay. All right? There's no way to get onto this levee from the right side of it. Right? Because it goes all the way down to the water. As far as we can tell. And so, to get on top of that levee, if there were water here, you would have to cross the water. Right there. Okay, we went down this road. What is it? 322. 322. We're not going any further. On the right hand side here that's um indian land see i don't know if you can see it but there's a big sign back there you can't go to the left i mean to the right anywhere down on this road okay and now we're not going down that road if that's the way to the spillway sorry we're not going to do it because that road is tore up Okay, and then on the way out, there's tons and tons of residential, so it's not here. And this is where we were, by the way, Los Ojos de Use Area. <laughs> 